the scepter of the wicked. And he's gradually putting them curses on Esau, man, and taking them curses away from our people. All right? That's what's going on in these days, man. So Esau's days is, is finished. His days are through. Okay? That's what's going on right now, man. And the uprising simultaneously is the uprising of Jacob. So right when, this, when these people are going down in their time, we're rising up at the same time. And the Lord is preparing the kingdom. Okay? So we're going to keep reading. It says, um, there's another verse I want to get to. And then I'm going to just close this thing out. I will make thee a perpetual destination, and thy city shall not return, and ye shall know that I am the Lord. So the cities of Esau, which is mainly America, which is also known as Basra in the Bible, okay, because Basra is wherever Esau is at, the majority of them. So the lands of Basra are going to be made desolate one time again, and they're not going to come back again. That's why in the of Malachi 4, it speaks about how this, you're not going to find either no root or no branch of them, of their kingdom. That's all I gotta say from there, man. I like to give all praise and glory to Yahweh Bar Hashem, Yahweh Shah. Okay, double honors to the head of apostles on down. You know, and everything like that, man. And uh, with that, man, I'm closing out. Shalom to all the brothers on down. Shalom.